Hello. I didn't see you get on. Are you concerned about the state of our railways? If so, you'll be pleased to know that Rail Corp is spending one billion dollars on our untangling the rail networks plan, which will bring City Rail into the future. This video will outline some of the changes. Stage one of the project is the introduction of a new line of trains. This is the Razor Bullet Train. Take a moment to read through some of its fine features. Now, let's board a train to better showcase our new improvements. As a side note, Railcorp has heard many complaints about trains often being late and inconsistent. To ensure a more reliable service, all trains will now regularly slow or stop so as to be consistently late. So, let us wait for a train. Or we could walk. With this investment in our train system, there comes greater risks. I'm sure you're aware of horrific incidents in recent years concerning trains. To match the rest of our upgraded network, all city rail guards will now be equipped with full body armor to deal with crimes such as littering, vandalism, and fare evasion. To combat littering, all transit officers will now be assigned a quota of littering fines to issue. Our ticket collection system will also be bolstered. If you are not carrying a valid ticket at all times, penalties may be severe. Finally, vandalism. Rail Corp will be implementing an exciting new system to combat trespassing on the tracks and other In the past, these transit officers have been accused of being incompetent, malicious, and sadistic. To resolve these claims, we have held sensitivity classes for all our officers. That is, they will now target sensitive areas during their beatings. Hopefully, this will silence the critics. We've also heard some disturbing reports that people are actually able to comprehend our announcements and may be able to discern when a train is arriving by reading one of our schedules. To combat this, Railcorp will be spending 100 million to introduce broken clocks, poor quality schedules, filler mistakes, and announcements that are certified as undecipherable even by the most advanced of computers. Attention, please. Lastly, let's take a look at how our new bullet trains will be built. Technicians selected from the top high school dropouts are paid by the hour to work hard to maintain the fine quality of our trains. If not for their hard work, our trains would likely be of very poor quality. I'm so happy, oh, happy that lucky me. I just go my way, living every day. I don't worry, worry don't agree. Things that bother you never bother me. Things that bother you.
So enjoy the future of City Radio.